Ivanka Trump got to crush some powder on Monday morning, with the 35-year-old ski bunny hitting the slopes in Aspen while on vacation with her family. The first daughter was photographed shredding down the mountain early in the day, outfitted in a white and grey jacket, charcoal-coloured ski leggings and a black helmet and goggles for her safety. She was joined by daughter Arabella on a few of the runs, with the five-year-old already looking like a seasoned pro as she showcased her French fry and pizza moves while skiing alongside her mom. The pair then met up with another mother-daughter duo as well, with Vanessa Trump and nine-year-old daughter Kai also taking a few runs with Ivanka and Arabella. Arabella was later seen enjoying an ice cream cone as she and her mom went to go meet up with three-year-old Joseph, who was off on his own ski lesson. The proud mother later posted a photo of her two snow bunnies on Instagram, writing, exhausted little skiers. Jared Kushner was having a far less exciting day back home in Washington DC on Monday, where it was back to work after spending the first half of the weekend with his wife and their three children. Ivanka and the children could not leave until after sundown on Saturday as the family observes Shabbat. Jared was photographed leaving for the White House on Monday at around 8 a.m., emerging from the basement of the family's $5.5 million rental home and glancing in both directions before darting into his waiting SUV. A Secret Service agent joined him in the waiting vehicle, stepping of the home about a minute prior to his boss while carrying a black leather weekender bag that appeared to belong to Jared. It was not a great day at work either for Jared or his boss, President Donald Trump, with FBI Director James Comey testifying in front of the House Intelligence Committee. Comey made it very clear during his testimony that he had no information to back up President Trump's claims that Barack Obama wiretapped the phones at his eponymous tower on New York Fifth Avenue. That was not all either, with Comey also testifying that there had been an active counterintelligence investigation into claims of collusion between the Trump campaign and Russian intelligence since last July. Jared did not join President Trump at his rally in Louisville later in the day on Monday, suggesting that he could be heading off to Aspen, adjust back home.